L'Écosse aura à offrir ses capacités les meilleures aux Africains et les Africains devraient nous donner aussi des choses les meilleures d'Afrique en échange, les meilleures de nous. Par exemple, le fait que le Congo a réussi à devenir indépendant de, 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 de la grande Belgique en, en 1960 et que l'Écosse aujourd'hui ne parvient pas à devenir indépendant de la Grande-Bretagne, il y a des leçons à retenir là-dedans. Donc, on a une richesse. Et ce sont des choses comme ça qu'il faut échanger entre les universités, les meilleurs penseurs du monde, les personnes les plus intelligentes au monde pour faire un monde meilleur. And they say to me, We've appreciated the work you've done in Scotland, particularly your anti-racist campaign. We've seen your petition moving forward to the parliament and is, is still there, strong, moving. And we want to see the same work doing through the university. Mm. So for me then, it was a relief, but I cannot lie, I was scared because no one, no one in 437 years has mm. tried to get to that place. Before. I was born in Kinshasa, yes, and I went to school in Kinshasa. I went to primary school, secondary school, and university in Kinshasa. I attended law school in Kinshasa. It's about time that Africa realized that when you educate your citizen properly, there is a potential on mm. those people that you educate, and they're capable of giving their best wherever they go and how they go, as long as the education is the best one. that the university have of me is that I introduce this wave of anti-racism on the education system to see the rectorate dealing with this kind of situation, the racism, because it exists, all right? Racism exists and the, our education system has to be able to recognize those gaps that exist between and make sure that all community within the university community are valued and respected as equal. <music> With immigration, the immigration service we, which gave uh, two kind of visa to, stu to students And mm. some of them, some is quite favorable, some is less favorable. And they keep giving to students the less favorable kind of visa. So mm. I think when I spoke with the student uh, last representative last time, I said, we, we need to open a dialogue with the immigration service and try to get them to understand that it's not in anyone's interest to have people coming in this country, getting the education they get and using this education someplace else. Mm. You know, if they choose to stay in the country, if they choose to explore the intelligence they have in the country, so why not giving them that? It's, it's quite something, somebody told me it's going to be challenging, but I'm not afraid of immigration system, to be honest with you. I've been through the system, so I know uh, they are human beings just like